Hello and welcome to this screencast on installing XM on Windows 7. I'm going to show you how to install it. First you want to go to uh, patchyfriends.org and once you arrive at the site you're going to come up and choose the XAMP icon. Uh, from here you want to click XAMP for Windows and you want to scroll down um, and click on under download click XAMP and you'll see XAMP for Windows 1.7.4 uh, you want to download the installer file and then you'll be asked to save it to your downloads folder or you can save it to your documents wherever you prefer I actually already have it saved so once you once you have it downloaded uh, you want to go to uh, in this case I'm going to my downloads and look for XAMP uh, icon here for the EXE installer you're going to click it it's going to ask you the user account control is going to ask you if you want to allow you say yes and then you'll see install a language I'm going to choose English you can choose from English um, only two languages so I'm going to choose English um, this basically is saying that there's you won't have enough permission if you install it under program files um, so in this case we're just going to install it directly to the C drive um, and, and trying to avoid this way so just click OK the wizard will pop up or click next to continue uh, you'll see the destination folder CXAM we'll hit next and then these two here the service selection don't don't check those um, basically you want an icon and this will put a folder in the start menu you can uncheck that if you want um, I'm just gonna go ahead and leave it as it is and hit install this may take a few minutes uh, to install on your machine so what I would do is um, give this a few minutes and I am going to uh, return back to the screencast uh, for part two um, of installing XAMPP because this is going to take a while and it's going to I'm going to run out of time for this screencast. So um, thanks for watching and be sure to tune in for part two of the XAMPP screencast.